72 people were killed in the Grenfell fire tragedy. This came about due to negligence. And that's if we're being nice. Now, in care work, if you are abusing the people you're meant to be looking after, you will go to prison. If you neglect them, you get a much harsher sentence. The Glenfield tragedy was completely avoidable, but due to Tory neglect, 72 people died. Recently, every single Conservative decided that those lives didn't matter, as they voted to do nothing about it. And now, as that extra little kick when people are down. Files on Grenfell Tower cladding lost forever after deletion from a laptop. Now this is um, written in Vox, I'll link it down below. But, um, Jesus. So I'm not going to... Um, insult this person by not getting their name right uh, but the design manager who worked for cladding specialist Harley or Harley facades until March 2016 told the hearing he erased his work computer of all files after agreeing to keep the device despite leaving the firm Harley managing director Ray Bailey said Daniel, whatever, left Harley some months ago before the fire. But at that stage he had both deleted all of his Harley related emails from his laptop and had arranged with our service provider to remove his email file from our system. However, <clears throat> asked about this by inquiry lawyer Kate Grange, QC. Uh, he said, I don't know what he means by that. I didn't arrange for that to happen. I don't think I would have the authority or the security to do that. Now again, I'll, I will link this down below. But essentially, what this is now said, uh, the, the final line is this, is a former employee allegedly said that they would keep their emails and the data on their laptop even when they don't work for the company now that's an issue that is a big issue um, first and foremost it being deleted there's a um, it's not that simple to delete stuff now I, I know there are a lot of tech savvy people out there but Here's, here's the breakdown. When you delete something from your laptop, you then have to go into the recycle bin and delete that. But that doesn't mean it's gone forever. If you want to make sure the thing is gone forever, you need to completely wipe your laptop. And someone who's very tech savvy will be able to recover a lot of the data that's been deleted. When it comes to a server, again, this is not something he has as, as an employee. He wouldn't have the authority to do unless he ran the entire thing which again he wouldn't have the authority to do because he left the company in 2016. This is a bullshit excuse. This is a bullshit excuse that has been given when the government and the government's biggest party, Parliament's biggest party have all said we don't 72 people died in that tragedy and it wasn't just because of cladding the sprinkler system didn't work there were a number of issues it was negligence the conservatives just said we don't care conservatives like Jacob Rees-Mogg at the time blamed the victims because they listen to the fire brigade. This is possibly one of the most disgusting things that could happen 
from a tragedy like this. Let's stop pretending that the Conservatives care.